Good morning, everyone. God is good and he is worthy to be praised. We want to make sure that when we wake up in the morning, we're thanking him for waking us up in our right minds. Yes, we're in our right minds. We give God thanks. Today, the word came to us from Psalm 37. <clears throat> Fret not thyself because of evildoers. Many times when the evildoers step up their game and start the one bag of witchcraft and voodoo and hoodoo and hex and vex and all these things, it can really vex your spirit. It can re really cause it to come to a place where you're thinking that, oh my God, I can't bother with this. And you know, you get anxious. But the Bible <clears throat> exhorts us to not be fretful or anxious for what they will do. Because the Bible says that the wicked shall be cut down. And can I prophesy to you because the word of God says so, that, that, that witchcraft shall be cut down. All the hypocritical mockers in feet shall be cut down. All those sabotage and spite that the wicked is carrying on, it shall be cut down. And you go in your prayer closet and you begin to pray like that, that the wicked shall be cut down. Agree with the word of God that the wicked that you see, the spirit of hate coming up against your life for no reason, shall be cut down. You begin to decree and declare that the spirit of the wicked shall be cut down. God is with you. Let me tell you something. In Psalms 115, the Bible says that God shall increase us, us and our children. It is a promise from God. Begin to agree with the promises of God by declaring them over your life. Say, yes, God, I believe that you're going to increase me and my son, me and my daughter, me and my grandson, grandchildren, godchildren, stepchildren. Right? Believe the word of God. Don't let it go. Not because it's the wicked carrying on. Probably it's a wicked baby father or a wicked whatever. Bring the word to God that says, you will bless me. You will increase me and my children. Right? So we give God praise for his word this morning. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I want to thank you, Lord God, for the person that is watching. Father, I pray, oh God, that you will cover this person in the blood of Jesus Christ. Deliver this person from the wicked, oh God. The wicked that is spreading out. The wicked that looks like Almighty God. They are unconquerable. Father, I pray, Almighty God, Rebenda Rabba Shakata, that you will begin to lift up a standard against the wicked that is operating against this person, Almighty God, under the sound of my voice. Father, I thank you, Almighty God, who she came back, Runda Rekanda Rebe. Robo Shakata, I rebuke every wicked spirit harassing your life this morning in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the Lord. Rebuke every wicked spirit harassing your life. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, I thank you for blessing Almighty God, the person that is watching with the abundance of peace. In the name of Jesus Christ, let the abundance of peace come to this person's life. Lord, remember to bless their children, bless their bread, bless their water, oh God. Protect them and continue to provide for them. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, I pray. Please type amen in the chat if you receive this prayer. Next, I want to remind you that 6 a.m. Mondays to the Fridays, I am on TikTok here. <clears throat> Please come and join the prayer. Come and pray for your husband, pray for your wife, pray for your children, pray over your mind, pray over your salvation, pray over your prayer walk, pray over your worship with Almighty God. Do what you need to do. But just try and make it a date, right? And don't be late. 6 a.m. sharp. God bless you.